What's up everybody? Um, I am going to show you how to use Flash Fire to install Exposed in our little, our little famous mod, which I have not gotten to it yet. Let's see, no, I want nothing on an SD card. Uh, where is it? Settings. As you can see, I don't have the FHD 60, so I'm on the stock version of uh, LG's camera. So what we're going to do first is I'm going to install Exposed. And then uh, I'm going to show you how to do the same thing with a camera mod. So just what I'm going to show you pretty much works all the same way. And then you'll see a video of what my phone's doing, which this process does take at least 30 minutes for your phone to do something. So what we're going to do is, is we're going to get our flash fire. Again, I will not provide this. We're going to grant it. Agree. No thanks. You can follow the person if you want to, but I don't use Twitter or anything like that. Um, I've actually had somebody ask me uh, what version I am running. And as you can see on the top, I am running version 0 0.224. And when I done the Flash Fire upgrade, uh, not upgrade, but... Yeah, their updated version of it, it really did not do nothing for me. So I am staying to what works until the, the newer one is fixed. So for now, I'm staying with this. Um, what I'm about to show you will work on every way. And what we're going to do is we're going to press that button, that plus button. And you see where it says flash, zip, or OTA. Click on that button. And navigate to where you put the files. Uh, my, and I've put them in my downloads folder. And right there we got the exposed V80. And I'm pretty sure that in the future you'll have a higher version. Uh, so like I said, this all works the same way. And if there's changes, I'll make an updated video. And at the same time, if you want the camera mod, as you see, camera underscore 60 FPS underscore 64 MB PS dot zip uh, you can just click on that as well so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna do expose because that's one of them I'm really gonna need and after you get whatever installed you can install the camera mod as well same process to what I'm going to show you so I'm gonna go to exposed do not touch nothing just click on the check mark and then what we're going to do is we're going to go down here and hit flash. Uh, as soon as you hit flash, leave your phone alone. Don't touch it. Don't even try to power it on. Don't try pulling out the battery. If you do so, you will take the high risk of breaking your phone. Or maybe you get lucky that your phone will come back and maybe with an error. So again, do not remove the battery. This process will take about uh, 15 to 30 minutes. I think 15 minutes to where you'll see all these command lines, which I will show uh, with my G3, uh, what it will look like. And then after all those command lines go through, then we are going to uh, see our phone stay in blank for another 15 minutes. And after that 15 minutes, you'll see the phone boot in. I'm not going to hit flash right now, but on your end, hit flash. And I can do it this way too, because I have done it this way. Once you get that exposed uh, installer installed, uh, we are going to use our favorite uh, file explorer and navigate to wherever you put your exposed installer at. We're going to click on it and we're going to click on install. If your phone comes up with a security saying that, uh, well, with Flash Fire, um, I'm pretty sure it probably won't, but on my phone it did because I'm running off a of backup. But if it brings up a message saying, uh, uh, allow unknown applications just click on setting and check mark unknown sources and once you check that you'll be back over here to this installer page and we're going to install our exposed installer now my exposed framework is going to give me an error because I did not do it uh, for the installer package but I'm installing this first just to show you how to install exposed so when you go in framework and just say okay and you won't have all this red lettering or anything yours will have green letters on the top 
uh, saying what version or I forgot what it will say. Well, it will tell you that it's working properly. It's functioning right. So it will be in green letters. As for mine, mine is red because I don't have that installer in here. So once I get the installer, mine will be showing the green. So that is all I am showing uh, how to do this. And uh, after I get the exposed uh Un uh, installer into my phone along the camera mod I'll go ahead and I'll do another video of this to what it will look like when they are installed so when you see your phone do this don't touch it it's gonna do this for about a minute or two and then it will cut off like I said it's the LG G4 so now I got another 15 minutes. As you're like waiting for 30 minutes or so, you'll be with your family, go play with your dog or something. So yeah, this is gonna take a bit. Same thing with the camera mod and uh, and uh, another step that I'll be showing uh, later on, which you guys might think it's cool. There is a video that I made how to back up your system image. So. I'm showing you what all this looks like when we're doing flash fire, and then I'm going to go on do an e-video about a system image. Alright, after you install Exposed and probably the camera mod, which there would be links in the, below this video, I'm going to show you what it looks like when they're fully installed. I'm going to start with Exposed. As you saw earlier on my video underneath Framework, I had all that red lettering because there was like an error because I don't have that installer before. And as for uh, the green letters, that's what it will look like on the top to let you know it's active. So we got that. Now, if you, like I said, the camera mod is done the same way as you're installing the exposed framework. Uh, so once you get that done, you'll get this. I'm outside right now. I'm not going to do the 50, uh, 60 frames a second uh, through my phone because. Uh, you're, you're not going to see the true experience of it. I'm going to turn off my flash so I don't have that on. But I am going to show you that the option does exist, as you see right there. It's in blue in the second area. Uh, FHD60. Uh, that is where you will have the 60 frames a second. Uh, there will be a link posted on this video probably right about now that you see it floating uh, you can click on that link to see what it looks like with the 60 frames a second uh, uh, when it's recording I'm not gonna have the video mixed in here or it's not going to look right so the video is gonna be separate unlisted but the link will be provided as you see floating on the YouTube window